I'm about to double your pleasure. Hey, Power Director peeps. Yes, you're blessed. It's Tablet Tuesday. And today, I'm going to show you how to make the double exposure glitch effect using the Power Director Mobile Video Editor app. If you're new to my channel and you want to learn how to use Power Director, click the subscribe button and click on the bell to get notifications every time I upload content to YouTube. Here we are in Power Director Mobile. The exposure glitch effect is a dynamic effect that can be used in just about any type of video. It uses pictures, videos, a glitch transition, and blend modes to make a cool effect for your videos. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to make the exposure glitch effect for your videos. Let's fix this glitch. You need two images for this effect. The first is the original image. The second is the original image with darker exposure with a white background. Now, you can use any photo editor to make that second image. I'm not going to go into showing you how to do it. There's a lot of videos out there on YouTube that show you how to do it. So just look it up and knock it out. Once you have the images created, you can place them in your timeline. So you want to go to the media icon. You want to go to pictures. Go to the location where your pictures are at. You want to tap on the first picture and tap the plus sign. It'll add it to the timeline. Then you can go ahead and move your playhead to the position after that picture. Tap on the second picture, which is the one with the exposure that's darker and the white background and tap on the plus sign and it'll add it after that first picture. Next thing that you want to do is change the duration of the first image because we only want it on the screen for a short amount of time. So I'm going to tap on this first image and then I'm going to hold my finger over the end of the trim line and trim it down to like one second. Now we want to add that aberration glitch to the mix. What we'll do at this point is we'll go ahead and tap on the transition in between these two clips. We'll tap on get more. We'll tap on glitch. And we're going to use aberration too. So we'll tap on that and we'll tap the plus sign and it'll add it as the transition. Now we want to create some movement in that second image to zoom in on it. So we're going to tap on a second image. You want to tap on pan and zoom. We're going to tap on custom motion. And for the end position, we're going to pinch in on this and try to get it right in the middle of the face. So if we tap on play, it shows us a little good little zoom in there. So we're good to go. Now we want to add a video and blend it in with the second image. I'm going to tap on the second clip and then I'm going to tap on the overlay icon. I'm going to tap on the video tab. I'm going to go to the location where the video is on my device. I'm going to tap on the video and tap the plus sign and it'll add it to that overlay track right where my playhead was at, right where that transition takes place. And the first thing I want to do is go ahead and size this up. So I'm going to pinch out. Try to size it up to the size of the screen. And now I'm going to trim this to a position where I want it to start. And that's good there. I'm going to go ahead and hold my finger over this clip until I have the yellow border around it. I'm going to move this over right where that second image starts. I'm going to tap on it again and I'm going to trim the end all the way to the end of that image. Now I'm going to go ahead and add the blend mode to this to make it blend in with that second image. So I'm going to tap on this clip to make sure it's selected. Tap on blending. And here I'm going to tap on screen. And we're good to go. Now we can go ahead and play this back and see how it looks. I feel a glitch coming on. If you like what you see, I'll leave a link to trial Power Director Mobile in the video description. I know you want more Power Director love, so be sure to click on these videos to watch more of my content and smash my logo to subscribe. Don't forget to drop me a comment and a like down below.